It's Umsum time! What if our beard turned into snakes? So what? Umsum is not afraid of anything! Oh, Umsum. If our beard turned into snakes, hairdressers will definitely leave for a different planet. Hmm. Person with the longest beard will be feared by all. Hmm. Snakes are used to shedding their skin. We may start finding them everywhere. People with a phidiophobia, as huh? in fear of snakes, may start wearing huge masks at all times. Hmm. All wild animals may shift to a different planet. Hmm. Trimming our beard will be a thing of the past now. Hmm. Some people may huh? have snake bites all over their face. Hmm. Huh? Even villains will start running huh? away from us. Thieves will take full advantage of this. Huh? Hmm. Even aliens may start carrying out experiments on their beard. <laughs> hmm. To buy Umsum merchandise, visit umsum.com. What if uh, clocks and watches huh? disappeared? No problem. I am always on time. Oh, um, so. Firstly, if clocks and watches disappeared, people may revert back to the good old days of predicting time based on sun's position. Hmm. Secondly, if clocks and watches disappeared, meetings and functions may not start on time. There will be chaos everywhere. Hmm. Thirdly, some people like to meticulously plan as well as follow their daily schedule. If clocks and watches disappeared, huh? they will be mightily disappointed. Hmm. Fourthly, millions of people are employed in the designing, manufacturing, as well as sales of clocks and watches. If clocks and watches disappeared, huh? lots of jobs will be lost. Hmm. Lastly, if clocks and watches disappeared, latecomers will be the happiest Hooray! of the lot. On the flip side, some people are under constant stress of completing their work before deadline. If clocks and watches disappeared, <laughs> they may heave a sigh of relief. Hmm. Why do turtles huh? eat plastic? I am crazy about burgers. They are crazy about plastic. Oh, I'm some. <laughs> Earlier, it was believed that turtles mistakenly identified plastic bags for jellyfish. But this hypothesis was discarded when turtles were found huh? to ingest plastic debris which had no resemblance to jellyfish. Mm. Also, turtles were found entangled in large mats of plastic debris which had no visual resemblance to jellyfish. Mm. As per a study, it was found that smell played huh? a major part in loggerhead sea turtles eating plastic. Mm. How? In the study, it was found that these turtles were responding to airborne odorants from biofouled plastic. Now, this response was very similar to the way turtles responded to odorants from food. Mm. Researchers believe that dimethyl sulfide, a volatile odorant, might be responsible for such behavior from turtles. Mm. What if all volcanoes erupted at once? Don't worry, I will douse them using my umsum water jet. <laughs> oh, umsum. Even if we ignore underwater volcanoes, there are still about 1,500 active volcanoes on Earth. There are at least 20 volcanoes erupting on Earth at any given moment. Now, if all the volcanoes were to erupt at once, firstly, the entire atmosphere will be covered with clouds of ash and volcanic gases leading to respiratory <coughs> problems for many. Mm. Secondly, volcanic ash may lead to clogging of plane oh. turbines and eventual engine failure, resulting in the grounding of all the airplanes. Mm. Thirdly, as sunlight will not be able to penetrate the volcanic ash, entire world will be plunged into darkness. Mm. Lastly, 
Acid rain formed due to the reaction between volcanic gases and various atmospheric gases will destroy crops worldwide and also lead to ocean acidification. What if we start mining asteroids? Then I will open my mining company and list it on a stock exchange. <laughs> wow, Umsum. An asteroid is a small rocky body orbiting the sun. Millions of asteroids lie in the asteroid belt between Mars and Jupiter. Now, if we were to mine an asteroid, firstly, don't expect any new jobs as no human beings will be involved in the actual operation. Robots will be used to carry out the heavy duty work. Secondly, Earth would not be a pretty place to look at anymore as human beings would have exhausted all the avenues on Earth before going for mining on asteroids. Thirdly, prices of precious metals will be on cloud nine as they will be the reason why companies will aim for asteroids. Fourthly, gold, platinum, and silver might get jealous as new precious metals might be detected on far off asteroids. Why do our eyes become red? Because we color them using red paint. Oh, um, so, let me explain. Mm. Did you know that extremely tiny blood vessels are present on the surface of our eyes? Mm. Yes, they do. <laughs> when these blood vessels huh? get dilated or inflamed, our eyes appear red. Oh. In this condition, our red eyes are also sometimes referred to as bloodshot eyes. The most common causes of eye redness are allergies triggered due to irritants such as pollen, dust, perfume, or smoke. In this case, our eyes may also have itching, burning, or tearing. A condition called dry eye in which our eyes lack the tears necessary to nourish or lubricate them. An infection such as conjunctivitis. Sometimes conjunctivitis is also referred to as pink eye. Finally, Eye redness can also be a huh? result of trauma or injury to our Ooh. eyes. What if sun suddenly became half its size? Then I would play basketball with it. <laughs> oh, um some. Firstly, there would be no need of freezers or air conditioners anymore. Everything on Earth would completely freeze. Secondly, assuming that Earth is still orbiting at the same distance, Earth will find itself out of the habitable zone of the Sun, thus slowly but surely wiping out all life on it. Thirdly, oh. stocks of solar energy companies would completely tank as extremely less sunlight will reach Earth's surface. Mm. Fourthly, as there would be extreme scarcity of sunlight, Plants in order to perform photosynthesis would probably turn blackish or darkish green in order to absorb as much incident sunlight as possible. Lastly, as sun's gravitational huh? pull would greatly reduce, outer planets of the solar system, namely Uranus and Neptune, may drift away into space. Mm. Why do our eyes twitch? Because we use too much Twitter. What? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Eye twitching is also referred to as eyelid twitching or myokymia. Myokymia is a repetitive, huh? spontaneous, involuntary spasm or quivering of our eyelid muscles. These eye twitches are generally mild and last for a very short length of time. <laughs> but in some cases, they may be strong enough to force closing of both the eyelids and in some cases, they might last for a longer period of time. Mm. Eye twitches are considered to be oh. unpredictable, as in they do not follow any specific pattern of occurrence. Some of the common causes of eye twitching are eye irritation, fatigue, <sighs> lack of sleep, too much alcohol, caffeine, or tobacco, allergies, etc. Eyelid twitches are generally huh? considered to be harmless, but may require a doctor visit in some extreme cases. <laughs> What if Earth's core cooled down? Then I will heat it using my Umsum superpower. Oh, Umsum. Earth's core temperature is about 10,800 degrees Fahrenheit. Mm. If it cooled down, then there would be no earthquakes or volcanoes. Why? No heat means all the active volcanoes oh. would suddenly become extinct. Also, earthquakes huh? occur when tectonic plates rub against each other. 
These plates move because of the intense heat coming from the core. Now, no heat from the core means no movement of tectonic plates, thus oh. no earthquakes. Mm. Scientists believe that Earth's heated core plays an important mm. role in the creation of its <laughs> magnetic field. With no magnetic field, the following <laughs> things will occur. Our atmosphere will slowly but surely disappear as there will be no protection from harmful solar winds. Also, migratory birds would have a very hard time finding their destination. Huh? Mm.